Hi again. A student came to me the other day and said, Teacher, I just don't have enough time for classes anymore. I get it. Everyone is busy. But what is it we don't have time for? Think about studying, exercise, developing your cultural knowledge. Is it difficult to find time for that? And Netflix, scrolling through Instagram, happy hour. Did you know Mozart composed over 600 works of music? Van Gogh painted 800 paintings in eight years. Dr. Kepi is 95 now, still writing a book a year, doing weekly radio and TV programs, long list of clients. Seems that what we don't have enough time for are the most important things. Well, this is called an inversion of the will. The stuff that brings pleasure, that's easy. But the stuff that requires dedication and effort, yeah, that's a challenge. But that challenge is where we achieve real happiness and fulfillment because that's the stuff that's connected to purpose in life, to contribution to the world. Understanding this is the process of analysis that helps you control your inverted will. You know, there are two basic things that make us feel guilty. Doing something we know we shouldn't, that's obvious, but also turning your back on doing something good. So we can disinvert this illusion of not having enough time, or we can regret it later. I leave it with you.